My name is Hunter Erdman. I'm the designer at Bollinger Motors. So in the two-door and the four-door prototypes, we decided to do a monocoque vehicle structure in that we wanted kind of a stiff, rigid body to design around uh, all the powertrain components and the battery and all of the tough and ruggedness that you get out of that. It was a huge benefit. But as we developed the trucks further, we realized there was a lot of commercial applications that could be done with a skateboard type chassis. And not to mention, we could do different material types. So we could have an aluminum body, but we could also have a steel frame chassis. So in a monocoque chassis, the frame and the body are one. It's all welded together in, into what we call a body in white. And that's everything except for the doors and all the components that come off the truck. In a, in a body on frame, it, it's, it's, the body is separate from the chassis. This is our prototype chassis. We built this for our testing purposes, and we were able to use it to package protect for components and to test and prove out some of the systems. We could test the body separately from the chassis and vice versa. So if we want to do some test mules, it's much quicker to make chassis than it is full vehicles. So a lot of the things we learned on our platform here for our off-road trucks, we actually translated really well to our delivery platform. Uh, my name is Connor Kehoe. I'm a chassis uh, engineer here, chassis DRE. So we went from the chassis concept, uh, which you saw before, to the vehicle behind me, which is the chassis development mule. And in our delivery platform, we use a lot of the same components. We had to focus a little bit differently than in the off-road space. We were able to focus kind of on chassis design and really integrating uh, new ideas for low load floors and to be the lowest load floor class in electric delivery trucks, which was kind of a key goal for us. In the smaller vehicles, it's front wheel drive so that we can maintain a, as low of a load floor as possible. It makes it easy for the drivers to get in the back. On the bigger vehicles, we'll still maintain a, a very low load floor, um, just from the, the way that the whole vehicle is designed is a very flat battery pack. Uh, keeps the load floor very low, uh, makes it easier for uh, deliveries. And we were able to put that kind of engineering thinking from the off-road trucks into our delivery platforms so that it's kind of the most robust trucks out there.